Hello you guys, this is Example and I'm back on the Minecraft server and today we are going to check out what I have been up to in here. I have been busy working in this area. So we've got fuel, we got stuff to smelt and we've got results. Now over this side we've got iron and we've got flowers. So I've been AFK overnight and this chest has been slowly filling up. So if you want to see how this is all put together, keep watching because I'm about to show you. Okay, catch you soon. Alright, hello guys and girls. I'm back on the Minecraft server. This is example and I am hmm, up late. Can't sleep. I need to do some work. Yep, yep. So uh, previously... I've just recently got rid of all my, um, previously recently, <laughs> what kind of thought was that? Got rid of my iron golems, there's another guy coming now. Uh, there were like 53, and I ended up, well, no, there was 53. Well, it said 53, and I've got 53 iron, how does that work? That's not right. Uh, anyway, uh, so I've got, a, I've got 53 iron. And today I wanted to I wanted to upgrade this iron farm and instead of making it manual I want to make it automatic and I want to be able to collect the drops and then I guess uh, I'm not going to do it on this episode but I'm going to build a sorting system to sort the flowers from the iron yeah like that and uh, yeah, I think that's going to be good. That's a good start. Uh, the other thing that I want to do is uh, give this place some purpose. And I've decided that I'm going to do my towers uh, straight after this episode. And what I'm going to need to do is give this, before I actually do that, I need to give this area purpose. And now we talked, talked a while back about turning this into an industrial smelter. Uh, now exactly where I'm going to put the smelter, I'm not sure. We can go downstairs. Uh, but I don't want to be going down too far. Now there is a level under this, and that's got the redstone in for the crusher here. Which is um, something that we can do. Now I did have this area dedicated for the chests and things after we, um, we click drops from these guys. Now I can't go up there, that's the... Um, and that's the place where they sort of come down to their death. I'll turn around there for a second. And uh, so we can't dig up there, otherwise we'll flood the place. So yeah, I think uh, what I want to do is I need to block this off. Uh, and I want to use lava, but we've got this wall. Uh, hmm. Yes, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Uh, didn't think about that, did I? So we've got a wall that needs to be taken care of. So we need three blocks. One, two, three. So about here somewhere, we'll need to put a lava dispenser and the same on the other side. And that's because we've got a three by two area and not all the iron golems are going to get burnt. So I'm going to have to do dual... What was that, what was that noise? Was that my stomach? <laughs> uh, so I need to do... Yeah, like I said, jewel there. Right, so we need to do um, a dispenser, a lava dispenser, uh, and we need to do hoppers, and we need to make it so this place won't burn down, which means I'm going to have to change the way this looks a little bit. Now I was thinking I might make use of the nether rack um, and turn it into nether bricks, and, uh, and then line this whole part with those so that we don't catch anything on fire. I'm pretty sure I might be able to get away with that by having the lava rack just by short, you know, sh with a short burst. We might be able to, um, we might be able to, to um, stop the person catching on fire. What the? It's coming down the millions. Right, so, uh, I'm going to stop talking right now and, um, Okay. Oh, you fell and you, you came at the wrong time, mate. Came at the wrong time. Just about to get busy. So first of all, I need to block this off uh, so that we... Yeah, let me get rid of this water too. We don't need that water anymore. I want to block this off 
for now. Um, oops, too many. So they're just going to hang around up there for a while. Uh, we need to prepare this area. Okay, so I just lost my direction. Lost my direction. Throwing stuff into a chest and I just lose my direction. Right. I need to get some nether brick. No, nether rack. And I need some a whole heap of cobblestone. So, whoa. Mouse spares. Uh, so I need to actually I actually do need to clear my inventory. Um, for now. So I can fill up again. That's full. Uh, hmm. That's full. That's full. That ain't full. Okay, so that's all the kind of stuff we need. Um, iron. So we've got, actually, we've got a heap of cobblestone. We don't need that. So we need to get nether, nether brick. Uh, oh, we've got heaps of nether bricks. Alright, so we're alright. We're good. Man, open your eyes, boy. Open your eyes. Sweet. Sweet. Sweet! Oh. Keep it down! Keep it down! Keep, or keep it real, or both. Uh, no. So I guess we just need to get something started and then we can. Um, so we've got one, two. I just need to do a little mock up here because I'm not sure exactly how this is going to work. So let's say we've got that, right? And we've got. Uh, where's our hoppers? Right. So one going on top to feed it. Um, one at the back, and then, how does it come out? Does it come out like that? I'm not sure. So, if I put something in the top, where does it go? Let's put that in. Right, where'd that go? Okay, wrong place. So, if I put that in the back, where does it go? Right place, okay. So this one is fuel in. Yep. And then when it's done, where does it go? There? Does it not go through here? How do you get it out? If I... Do that? Where's it? Does it go in there? How do you get it out? Is it down? Is it down? Take it out. Oh yeah, sweet. All right, so I've laid this down. I think it's a bit overkill, really. <laughs> so I'm not sure this is all fully necessary. And but but and but 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 and I think I'm going to give it a go. Right, so. Uh, I've got some uh, nether brick, nether, sorry, nether rack. I keep getting nether brick and nether rack mixed up. It's just guessing, I think, when I say the word. So I'm going to put a chest right. Is it pointing in the right direction? No, no, it's not. Let's fix that. And then I'll explain to you what I've done. Right, that goes into that chest. Right, there we go. Actually, let's see if anything's come through. No, good. Right, so we've got. Let's break this down. We've got the line coming down through here. Now that's the fuel. We've got the line coming down here, which is the um, items to smelt. Now I can't cross these over because if I do, um, there'll be a contamin cross, cross contamination where they'll cross over and filter through in the wrong place. Um, I also thought that. Um, what we need to do is make sure that the items are actually filtered before they actually hit these hoppers. So even though we've got chests which have got like um, fuel and items to be smelted, they need to be sorted before they get there so we don't get any sort of um, cross contamination. And we need to put a block above the chest so that people can't open it and put things in. So the fuel comes down here and uh, yep, goes down through here and then into the back. So that's where the fuel goes into. Now that line goes all the way down the end. Then we've got the um, items to be smelted that comes through here, and then goes through this line on top, which drops straight through the top of uh, the 
something else. Oh. And then we've got the hoppers that come out all facing this direction going into this chest which collects the drops after it's been smelted. So the next test would be to go up there and put the items in the respective chests and then see if anything awesome happens. Um, now I should be able to do this and this and then I should be able to do uh, oh, wrong, um, this and oh there's my nether rack. near the rack and then there should be some smelting magic um, if there's not then I've done something wrong and to be able to work out what I've done wrong uh, could be a bit of a mission so yeah there we go we've got something, we've got something burning here so we've got iron, iron going into that one nothing going to there we've got a so yeah we've got near the rack backlogs this is what I was thinking you know like Ideally, there needs to be different different um, smelting stations with different blocks, or we need to lock them based on a um, item sorter. Uh, at the moment, so why did that stop at 64? Oh, that, there we go. Okay, so now, so the iron's gone. So the iron should have made its way to. There we go. The iron's made its way to the chest, and really near the brick. Oh, okay, so my. How come I can't place the nether brick? Oh! No, that's right. That's right. Okay. Alright. I'm thinking that I've got a block in my hand, right? Right? Right. <laughs> this is the, the joke's on me, right? So I've got... I've got that. But what I need to do is... Let's put this down here for a second. Let's grab some more of those. Um, I need to actually do this, don't I? There we go. <laughs> Oh, that so confused me. I was like, yeah, I got... What do, they, what do they call it? So I've got nether brick in my hand. And that's nether brick there. That's what that's what's confusing, right? So that's nether brick, and that's also nether brick. Right, so now to business. While that is doing its thing, and I'm guessing it's going to take a long time to finish that... Kind of waste of wood too, by the way. Give me some of that back. Uh, yeah, because I'm gonna need to use that for later. Hmm. I used a lot of iron already. It's good thing we've got these guys up here. So next, next part of the plan for today is to build our lava. Ah, oh, sweet. So I'm just on a little divergent trip here. I need to get some string. Um, I'm looking for spiders in particular. Hang on. Oh. Need me some string. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Got me some string. Um, I'm going to do some tripwire hooks. And I just needed some string. There's another spider up here somewhere. Spider. 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 Ooh. There's a world of hurt over there. Um, you can never find them when you want them. And when you don't want them, you find them. Come on, spider. Sweet. Okay. We're back in. We're back in. Right, so the deal is uh, we wanted to have some kind of lava trigger mechanism to kill our iron golems. Um, so, let's have a look. What have we got here? Let's say we're using that. Um, I think we've got that's not wide enough, is it? So it needs to be three for trip hooks to work. Trip wire hooks? Yeah. Uh, I should actually kill them all anyway with this one, because I'm not going to be able to get. I'm not going to be able to get far enough away. The two blocks. Yeah, I think one's going to be enough actually. I might just try it with one because I think that might be enough. 
Um, and if it doesn't work, then I always put another one in. Right, so then we need to get power to that. So it looks like it's just going to be that easy, right? Not quite. Not quite. I need another full block. Another full block right here, right? There we go. Right, anyway, that's not going to work. <laughs> what am I thinking? Hmm. Well, I'm going to have to go back and now find some... some material to make comparators. So I'll be back when I'm done. Alright, I'm back. I made it. Uh, I'm back with some stuff to make comparators. Now, I changed my mind. Uh, I was in here and I was trying to wear my um, lava dispenser and uh, ended up... <laughs> ended up uh, pulsing every time like you st you're still on here and it ended up pulsing like open shut open shut and um, I need a mono stable circuit blah 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 and I decided well you know what they're already getting lava damage from the lava traps so all I need to do is crush them so I think I've just rigged up this automatic crusher and it kind of it's kind of a little bit disappointed in that in that really but um, I know this is gonna work so they will die in that. So, hmm, apologies about the um, the idea of using a lava um, lava killer here, but the thing is, I, I'm, I want something that works, and I'm not super clever at um, the old redstone, so I think that'll do for now. Let's open this up. There should be some guys tap dancing around up here. He's dead. That's what, that's exactly what we want to happen. So that works, and there shouldn't be any more than you know a couple of guys come down at a time anyway. more than that actually. That's what was that. Right, so that is that. Now they will die in there. Um, that's the crusher. Uh, it's really simple. So we've got our tripwire hook um, which is attached to this block. We've got a redstone torch which is on. Uh, it's inverted here against that piston and so when the tripwire hook is um, activated that turns off and that turns on pushes the piston out. Oh! Okay, what we should really do is put some glass or put some kind of viewing platform in here so we can see what's going on. Now they're not going to be able to get out of there because they're three high. So I can actually just mow right through this. There we go. And yeah, sweet. That's it. So that's that's that bit done. Now. Um, it'll do for now, alright? I'm not I'm not overly happy with what I've done here. Uh, but in order to get it working, that's what I've done. And the next thing would be to think about how I can make that better. And um, then go back down and finish the smelting. Uh, finish our smelting area off. Uh, and so I want all the drops, all the iron and everything to come back, and the flowers come back up here, and including my smelted items, and that way we've got um, everything coming to a central place instead of having to go up and down all the time. Okay. Alright, so here's the deal. This is where at the moment the iron golem drops fall into this crate here. Uh, and I want to bring them back upstairs. Now I've started building this um, item elevator here. So I've got some droppers going up into a chest. And what I need to do... I think before I get them up there, I'm thinking I might want to uh, sort these maybe. Do I want to do that? Do I want to build a sorter right here? Because uh, then the problem is that I need to have... Maybe, yeah, maybe I will. Maybe I'll build a sorter because I think a sorter will be a better way to split these up. Because I can have um, 
flowers come up here, iron go up there, and yeah, then we can do something with that. And I'm going to pull all of this down up to about here. Because, actually no, I'm going to leave that, I might leave those. I need to leave the bottom ones in, but I don't need the top ones. So let's um, get rid of those. So the idea was that, you know, we were going to have tons of items come through. But in all reality, um, I don't think I'm going to be throwing that many um, items down here to be smelted. Let's see. Um, I'm going to need at least... So that could be the first sorter, which would be going in that direction, but then I've got some circuitry which is going to be around here. Uh -huh. Then the other one would be coming down here, so that would be really close to that. So we've got dropping on both sides, so I'm going to have to go back in the opposite direction and then have to use a whole bunch of hoppers to push my items back up. Keep it down! Guys! And push them back that way, so I'm going to have to come out this way. And that would bring me up to here. Alright, so this is the deal. I'm pretty sure that those are set up correctly. So, um, we've got items that come down here and they pass through here and go to nowhere. Uh, in this instance, um, if any foreign objects fall into the system, then they're going to end up going right through to there. So we could have a chest there just to catch those things. Uh, or we can come down and check it every now and then. I think we'll just put a chest somewhere there anyway, just in case. So the deal is that um, items go that way, from here to there. Um, if they find their way into this one, they are, it's pointing that way. And that's quite important. You can't have it pointing directly into here, otherwise I'll filter through. This one is correct. Uh, that one there is the one that's supposed to go into a chest. But for our purposes, we want it to go into here. Um, kind of like this. So uh, that's where we want the items to end up. Uh, and then they'll go into the bottom of that um, tower there. Um, no, that's wrong because... No, that's right. That is right, but the problem I've got there is that if I build my other tower, where's it going to be? Let's just do this. Um, so my tower will be there, uh, which means I'm going to have to have my other... Oh, that'll work. My other one's coming into there. That'll be fine. So, uh, let's get back to this. Um, so I've got the comparator coming out here this way. So when the items come down or get detected, fire off the comparator. Then I need to have um, something like this with the signal coming down this way. Yeah, like that. Then uh, there's supposed to be a... So that's right. So the signal comes down there, then it goes back this way. That way. Uh, and there's a block here. Okay, here's my problem. Here's my first problem. So underneath this, this is where the um, redstone torch is supposed to be. Oops, there like that. Right? Is that right? So it locks that one. Yeah, that's right. So that's locked. Um, But, I want it to be going into here, so... Uh, I have to break that down. Uh, think about this. Oh, come on. There, there, there. That'll fix it. So now, um, the item's going to come down here. It's locked, can't go through. It goes into this one, into there and then snakes its way around there. That's kind of a bit ugly, but that's what we want to do. And then, um... So we've got four iron trapped in there. That's what we want. We want iron there, and then... Um, the thing is... I need to work out how many items I need to put in here before it starts to work. 
Uh, so it's seven, so it's not good enough. Uh, I need this to start. Oh, there we go. So if we have five, five of those, let's see if it, let's see if it makes any if it works. If it goes any higher, this next iron golem comes in. He's gonna die. Okay. So it went up to three, down to two. Okay, that's fine. That'll work. Uh, so that means that we've got. Yeah, there's always going to be one stuck in there, right? There's two in there. Oh, okay, that's not good. Um, I don't want it to be stuck there. Ah. Ah. Huh? Oh, where'd that go? Um, so that redstone torch is also powering that, so I don't want that to happen either. So, let's see if we can sort this out. Um, it needs to go into that, and then travel through that one. Now that should stop that one from locking. Okay. Uh, then, so let's try that again. So let's throw in our iron. Should be passing through. There they go. Then they're all gone. There's one stuck in there. And two left in there. Okay, that's good enough. Now, the next thing. Uh, so that's the iron. The next one is the roses. The red flowers. Those there. And one of those there. This disappears. Woo! Uh, another block here. We want a comparator there. And some redstone dust there and there. And I believe that is our circuit. Yep. Then uh, we need some flowers. Okay. Um, See if it's the same with five. Yeah, that leaves two items, which is perfect. So from now on, if any flowers come through, they'll go down this line. Any iron comes down, they'll go through that line. We can see there's some iron come through there. Haven't seen any flowers. Oh, flowers must have come through. So we must have something here. We shouldn't have iron in there. Um, why would there be iron in there? Shouldn't be any iron come through. Okay. Alright. So that should work. What was I saying? <laughs> Have you guys had nerds? You know that wonka nerds? Man, they're good. So bad for me right now, but man. Just love them so much. Right. So we were trying the um, flowers and they went through. Okay. So there should be a bunch here there we go good now now we need to get these um towers working so what we want to do is just build a little platform here now we need to test the signal coming out so we need a comparator uh, facing that way so if there's any items that come into here so let's put one in there that should light up yep now what we need to do is we need to make a clock uh, so we need to bust out this now the clock's going to run this way it's just going to be a simple really really simple clock uh, put that on two ticks um, then have the redstone come round and back into itself so that's ticking every time there's an item in here that'll just keep ticking which is what we want. Now we're going to use the signal here coming out to power these. So we need to. Um, how are we going to do this then? Uh, we need to power that block, which lights up that torch. So that item should have shot up. Yeah. I uh, need to power that, so I need to get rid of this again. Uh, 
and have the signal because I don't want the signal to go back into here um, so we need to do this do I need to put a I'll do it anyway a repeater in here let's put it on cable ticks delay as well so now where's the, oh, where's the iron gone right so that should fire off that should depower that force it up and there it goes right and so this is just the old steppy you know steppy stone um, redstone stuff we've got going on here so we're going to come up and throw another redstone torch on top and then is it the last one? Oh yeah uh, so that one should power that block there so now let's see what happens uh, we can go up and test this so do, 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 do. Um, so let's go up and test it. So I just all I need to do is throw down a stack of iron into this where the um, iron golems fall. And it should um, come up into the chest. So let's have a look. First of all at this chest here. Uh, nothing in it. So that wasn't, that was me, right? Yeah. Uh, let's throw in. So there's one in the one in the system already so let's throw in a stack of 63 and then that should should start hearing some clicking Ooh. Um. no clicking why not uh. there's stuff going through the sorter nothing in here nothing there where's it getting stuck there why is it getting stuck there why oh there's a problem okay let's fix that okay the hopper was wrong So there should be some iron. Come on, no. Right. So let's drop in stack of sixty-four into there. Should go through the sorter. That should pulse on and off. Yeah, it is. Now this is starting to work. This items going up there. Sweet. Let's go up here. So we should end up with sixty-three, I think. Um, there's always one that gets stuck. Maybe two that get stuck. Yeah, they are still coming. Good. Okay. Well, that's sweet. That's working. Um, 